personalized marketing is uh, something that we all have to use or should be using, especially in this age, uh, when you send an email uh, using most programs today like Aweber, MailChimp, you can customize it, you can set up your, uh, your system to say, hey, hi, Angel, instead of, uh, hi, here's this. You know, you personalize your marketing. It, when you sell postcards uh, or mail, you add the person, the recipient's name, first name and last name for the most part. In the letter inside, if you use mail merge, you customize it to include the person's first name, at least, right? phone number, email, address, all those things are personalized. So let me ask you, why are not you why you are not doing it with your website? It, this is hard I understand for most people because for the most part what you have to do is create multiple pages for all your clients. If for example if you have a thank you page for Angel Anderson, you right now you're supposed to be writing a thank you page for Angel Anderson so all the text is personalized to me except if you're using WordPress so let me show you what I'm talking about so what I'm talking about is, is this plugin that I've been, I had for a while it just uh, you know I don't promote it as often as I should because the, you know I don't know why but the plugin is really really good here it is and let me give you an example of a test page so for example these are some parameters and you know, I pre-fill some fields so you can see, you know, first name, last name, email address, uh, email address, uh, current time. So this is some short codes or some codes that I already have built in, but you can get creative even with a countdown timer. And I have another YouTube video so you can see and you can see uh, how this works out, right? So for example, let's say that I'm crafting a, a message using Aweber and here is the link that I will include if I want the log, you know, again, this can be cloaked with uh, HTML so people don't see this long link, but I am adding this uh, link here so you can see what is the parameter. So for example, if I knew, if I'm gonna send an email to James, right? The first name is James and the last name is Lynn, that's what it will look like. So I'm gonna copy and paste this into here, as so you can see, this is the page. It's empty right now in the first name. And I am going to copy and paste. And right now you see first name, hi, Lynn, uh, James, James, last name, Lynn, email address is AOL. So, so it's the exact same thing as here, right? And version two is if you're gonna use Aweber, for example, or MailChimp, instead of putting James, right now I just wanna pass the first name and the you know the last name the first name and the email if i want to use aweber what i do is i go to the personalized field click um, click on the in the personalized field and i personalize this te this text here with uh, the first name and the email address field that aweber collects so these fields have to be specific for aweber it's very easy because that what it is is um, if you add the first name fix and the email everybody that is in that list will be you, when you send the email will have a personalized text in your landing page so for example let me tell you i send an email right this is the same email you see here in aweber and i send it to the a test so aweber i send it to myself and aweber automatically you see this is the second email so instead of showing first name here and email address here like it says here, right? First name and email here. So email, first name. Instead of doing that, what I, the person will receive is their name, which is in the in Aweber's database, and their email. So when you click here, and uh, when you click and it comes up, it will say Angel. You see no last name because I didn't add the last name. Angel, Angel Anderson, and the time. And you can get very creative with all kinds of fields, phone numbers, etc. This can be useful for any type of business, appointment cons uh, co confirmations, uh, landing page on the thank you, be more personalized, say, hi, thank you, angel. You know, when, when some, somebody sees their name there, it's like you're talking to them. Remember, it, personalized marketing one-on-one -on -one is very key for you to engage in your message to be more effective. Again, I'm gonna drop up the link here below I highly encourage you to grab this uh, plugin before 
you know, like the price goes up, which it will go up, um, very, very soon. Uh, and this is not a scare tactic. It just, um, I'm going to be adding more things in the back end. The back end right now has uh, some amazing uh, tutorials. So this is the, uh, the video tutorial showing you how to use it. You download the, the link and uh, you create a, uh, here is a swipe and deploy uh, secret strategy that we use in direct marketing, but also it can be used for your own line with a gift certificate and everything and some other things that, you know, we, uh, and, and resources and links for you to grab around. So go ahead, visit W, is it the, the plugin is called WP uh, Personalized. So WordPress Personalized because it will help you personalize any post or any page in your WordPress Power side. Again, Angel Anderson here. See you in the next video. Bye bye.